I've been living here at Port Wollonga for 10 years and I also travel to town a few days a week to work at UniSA. So the rest of the time is spent pretty much um, making work in my little shed in the backyard, which I really enjoy. The work that I've made for the Jam Factory show is largely influenced by the ocean, the, the Port Wollonga beach. And I've noticed um, progressively over the 10 years um, the amount of rubbish that I've found and these pieces are inspired by that rubbish and how it's becoming part of our natural environment. I heard something on Radio National a lot long ago about how the ocean was becoming almost like a rubbish soup, like a plastic soup. And it started to make me think about how all that rubbish is becoming part of our natural environment. And we just don't see it anymore. Even though we think that the beaches are clean, the sand is full of tiny little bits of plastic. It's just becoming part of our everyday life. And as much as that is kind of pretty yuck, I kind of find it interesting as well. And I really enjoy finding those little plastic bits and pieces on the beach. So there's a bit of a love-hate relationship with the, the plastic that I'm finding. They're almost like little jewels, I guess, in amongst all the, the, the sand. And I guess the pieces that I've made for the jam show, um, they look like um, local plants. So, but in actual fact, they're made up of bits of rubbish that I found on Port Wollonga Beach. So I've m made moulds, simple moulds of tennis balls, little plastic, and this is one of them, a little plastic cordial container that I found on the beach. And then I can just cast them in doll porcelain that I use. So I make all of those components. I also use cast sticks as well that I find on the beach. And I make up all these components, keep them all together um, keep them damp and then I can then go and um, place them all together so they actually look like natural forms or, or plant forms that we would see in our environment but they're actually made up, up out of um, rubbish plastic components. So they would be the two together so they'd be attached like that. So I just kind of wait until there's a little skin on the inside and then and pour that back in. This one I can now join. Yeah, so what, what I do is I... Um, so I end up with these sticks and then I have to join the sticks together so they're longer. And then I get make all these components and then I add these on separately with this. This is what I get left with. This little stick here. And then I can go along and just join these on with this afterwards. I guess as well as making these works that I've made for the Jam Factory show, I also make production work for shops and galleries um, around Australia. And um, these are some of the pieces that you can see in the back there. So these are production cups for sale in shops around Australia.